Okay, my friends. So we are inside the part three for creating a Laravel photo gallery, and we have created this uh, create page here to create a album, and we need only the title. We have a button here, and if you go here now, I want to make this. Uh, when this form the work so we don't need this remove and add the method here and method is going to be post and uh, add action and it's going to be the route here and route is going to be albums store and save yeah, we have we need to add the CSRF token hit save and the button I think has the default type so if I go here yeah the type is sub submit so we don't need to add the type submit here and in the album controller uh, we need to add the store here the record so I'm going to create uh, or just album and create and title to be the request the request title oh, sorry the request title and save Go here and refresh, and for example, I'm going to add Orchan here. Create uh, and if I go now to the table plus, sorry, okay, the table plus, yeah. Here we have the ocean here and try it again. Now before we try I'm going to redirect the uh, return and redirect to the road albums index and save and go to the Albums now. Mm. Hit that create button, and I'm going to add uh, USA, for example, and hit create. And now we are redirecting back another one. Europe create we are back if I go and refresh yeah and I want to display the all the records here so first inside the index method I go and make a variable uh, albums here and we need to get all Okay, and add it here. So we helper of me compact method uh, albums and save. So inside the index now we have that albums here, and I need to make a 
blade for each here and for each albums as uh, album and here I'm going to add this okay we need the ID to be the album ID and here it's going to be the album title and if I save go and refresh here yeah we have the Ochan the first one use USA Europe and ID for five six you maybe have different ideas but I, I made it before three of them and now we have with ID for the first one okay now in the next video I'm going to make a button or two buttons here one for the edit and the next the other one for to delete the record okay so see you in the next video